You lost. You're back. Please, tell me what you found. Let me see that. Huh, I knew it. Gratian's death wasn't because of a rockfall. It was just a story to keep people away from the tombs. Now that I have his journal in hand, I can get some closure from the East Empire Company. Make them pay for lying to everyone. Thank you. Now, I believe I owe you a little more than a debt of gratitude for all that work you did. Here, it's not much, but it's the best an old retired miner can do. Those cowards left decades ago. Every single damned one of them. The moment the ebony mine dried up, they pulled up stakes. Ridiculous. Solstheim is still rich in ebony ore. I know there's more down there. I can smell it. I come from three generations of miners, and I'm telling you that the East Empire Company was wrong. They just didn't want to spend the coin trying to find it. Our home has stood in Raven Rock since the colony was founded. Grayson helped build it with his own two hands. After Grayson died, he left behind a wife and a son. My grandfather, Relicus. Relicus lived there for quite a long time, working in the other sections of the mine until he was slain by reavers. I never knew my father. My mother and I always lived alone. I asked her about him many times, but she seemed angry and refused to speak about him. So eventually, I let it go. When I was old enough, I began working in the mine, hoping to make my fortune and eventually move to the Imperial City. Unfortunately, yes. I only had enough coins saved to send one of us back to the Imperial City. So I sent my mother alone. I wanted her to see her homeland before she died. Until I met my darling Aphia, yes. I suppose you could have called me a bitter old hermit. Now I'm just old. Mark my words, Ravenrock isn't finished yet. <laughs>